Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Survival Chaos. We're gonna be up against Tolson, and we are gonna be facing Psy Dispens and Sapphire as well. It's only Psy's a little bit unknown to me. Before that, we got some big balls. Well, we did not play with base fan for a little while. <laughs> Uh, here goes my hope of getting our enemies wrecked early on. Ooh, ooh! <clears throat> oh man, I wish we had the early game bonus. We're surrounded by gold. Absolutely surrounded by gold. Oh, this mage going in first. That's not gonna be good for us. Because... By nature, we should be able to beat up the Foidos early on. But if we, since we're losing mages... We might be losing this hard. Big shame there for us. Total disgrace that we are losing into the Foydos already. Oh my god, Stolz is playing with the Undead. That's not gonna be good. At least Scarlet Crusade should be pissed off at the Undead. But Foydos and Undead on our side, that's not gonna be good. But until he gets the Necromancy up, we should be fine against him. Um, Inquistus, I think they have some anti under the ability, don't they? I might go be going bottom first, <clears throat> since we're losing this late. We win this hard, but if he goes to 2 right now, we should probably still be able to take control of the gold mine before he can. So I think that's all good. And I suppose he's going for fortifications or necromancy first before going for for a tattoo barracks. Hmm. Take damage. Okay, interesting, interesting. Some hentai under the ability. Hmm. <laughs> no, you guys are crazy. Absolutely crazy. Wait, my plan is to dominate early on. Maybe hurt the enemies at the early stage of the game enough that we can nuke them into oblivion later on. I think that's a dream for us. He's gonna be fighting over here, I suppose. Yeah, we're gonna get early tier 2 barracks everywhere. We might even be rushing a tier 3 barracks middle lane. But if we're gonna be in control of side lanes, we should be swimming in the gold. <laughs> oh, me and Rip, you're giving me really nasty ideas. You went to make sense. Oh, Scar Crusade stayed to mid lane. That's a shame for us. Yeah, since we're not upgrading our units yet, he should be able to counter stack us. Void Fallen Warriors, that's the tier 2 replacement, I believe. I wouldn't mind him in control of the mid lane as long as he would attack me, but that's gonna take ages, and I'm not gonna wait for that to happen. So we might be feeding him a little bit in the uh, mid lane. But so be it. So be it. <coughs> yeah, he's gonna be in control soon enough. He upgrade right side first. Interesting move. But he's certainly gonna be attacking us. Yeah. <clears throat> he's gonna get way more gold there than we do. Let's go! Let's upgrade like crazy now. Still hope he would push through, but... We might have... Being forced to wait for like five minutes before that would happen. We got fortifications up. <coughs> uh, maybe we want to steal air rats quickly. Might not be finished before this wave attacks me. But he's still coming in quicker than I expected. This wave. Oh, maybe we should have waited with that upgrade. Ah, well, we should be fine. We should be fine! <clears throat> I 
the hopefully the X upgrade we're gonna be able to at least eliminate the Inquistus. Stay away from barracks, please. I know they like to eat it. Okay, we're fine. We, we're gonna take two hits. But we can deal with it. He's still two, but no necromancy yet. So I think we are gonna be staying in control over there. We'll still take the stick. We yeah, have 30 seconds. Yeah, we're not gonna be surviving that long. Yeah, I will wait with the upgrade because we, if I upgrade now, this wave will cost me a fair bit of gold. I'd rather just use the air fully. Get all light up. We good at yeah. Crusades will probably remain in control of the middle lane. I have to take two hits there. Just have to uh, wait to see when this next wave will arrive. But look at them. Those sea dots are crazy. We go tier 3 here if we want to, but... I don't know. <clears throat> I don't think that would be smart. Why did he get the extra ghoul? There's only ways of gold for him. Oh, we got the Vanguards up. Yeah, he's trying to keep the Necromancy alive. I see that... Because he just got the Necromancy up. I think he might actually be okay. Remain in control. We'll see, we'll see. Let's go! Oh man, it's gonna be so close. He will get this next wave soon again. Which might just be enough for him. At least we got the healing. Yeah, we're just not scratching those necromancers yet. That's a shame. I think we should be happy that we just went to free here, man. Oi, oi, oi. You know what? Let's just silence them. Maybe we can stop the necromancers from spawning skeletons. And stay in control here. That would definitely be a big thing if we can keep control of the metal mine. <coughs> oh my god. Silence already gone. Okay, yeah. Uh, we're losing this. That's a shame. If the Undead and the Voidal still tier 1 mid lane, it's not gonna be any use for him to send a hero against my tier 3. We're not even losing here. Freaking hell. That's not good. <clears throat> nah, he's tier 2, he's also tier 2. Good to know, good to know. Go for the extra armor will hopefully allow us to counter stack him, but it might actually feed this wave a little bit, and that wave will grow exponentially. This mid lane should be worth something for us here. That was certainly white main, right? So it could go Anthony or Anduin mid lane. <clears throat> South white main indeed. I'm not so convinced about Anduin mid lane because he is a fighter. He can kill enemy heroes quickly, but he never really seems to be going for enemy heroes. Can we please gain control here before the next tick? I would like the 75 extra gold. <clears throat> it's gonna be close. I think this ranger will keep him in control. 
No, we got it. <laughs> it's my lucky day. I'm gonna get that one up before he attacks me. That's just wonderful. Gosh, what a delight. <clears throat> you know what? Maybe I'm insane. Just a little bit. Let's kill them all. Let's just keep upgrading. He's not gonna be pushing through anytime soon. And we definitely want the Bliss spell up soon, so... Being tier 3 isn't gonna be worth it against the Undead. He will get extra Necromancers if he goes tier 3. Yeah, survival mid lane is gonna be a bane. At least he will have to deal with it. Yeah, let's get the Blizzard spell ASAP. Probably the Arcan Exploits as well. Some love the AoE will also result in easier kills at the middle lane. And I could be throwing a hero against us. The arrow fully because of the silence. It's a channeling spell. It couldn't hit our backline. So you waste the mana, but could not hit us. <laughs> That's evil. That's just mean. Now, Red not send a hero here. Again, survival. Let's go. I don't know inspiration aura really because the Benabars gives inspiration aura as well, right? Oh no, it's bonus damage. Hmm. Glory to the scourge. <laughs> oh, I knew it. I knew it. <clears throat> Glory to the scourge. Oh, he's gonna be an absolutely pain in the ass. He's definitely gonna be able to counter attack us. There's not much we can do about it. Sending arrows to reduce enemy armor. So everyone will be losing these gold mid lane. Oh my god, can we actually steal salt? Why me? <coughs> I mean, it's gonna get close, especially with those tentacles fooling around. But I think we got a <laughs> perfect. Yeah. Let's pump up the AoE against the Undead. But this monstrosity will cost everyone a fair bit of gold. Stolz and go for the gold starvation tactic. Or it's a bit mean. But it was to be expected. Bliss spell incoming. It shouldn't be worth slay, but it might be worth to get at least a few fortification upgrades. The free bottom would be epic. As I said, I want to damage the enemy barracks early on so that we can potentially get rid of them with the nukes. But I think I will go Inspiration Aura. At least we're still getting some gold from here. Yeah, we should be careful with those skeleton maulers, I believe. They got siege damage with the demolisher trade. So they will burst quickly through my buildings. That's why I really hate dealing with Artis. Because he can easily solo a enemy tower early on. <coughs> We've then spawned the best time for us. Let's get inspiration aura. Maybe knocking shield would be one volt. Defend probably as well. Could send a hero to count him. Ready for action. 
this reinforcement here is actually fine for us because it means we're gonna get a big wave here. He will attack us sooner. Got rid of him pretty, pretty good. Hopefully he's not gonna be sending out any more skeletons. At least we are mana draining, which is kinda good against the necromancers, the death knights and enemy heroes as well. Oculus at least is slowly dying. Oh boy, we might be feeding him some tier 3 waves. Let's get the Fosion Aura. Pop up the armor. Definitely want the extra damage as well. And the extra units. We'll send another hero. I honestly would not be surprised. Men of Lord Run. Let's go. At least keeping control over the gold mine. We might be trying to save here. If you use the air fully. He did hit it once, but... Oh my god, that's so good, man. <coughs> that's such a troll uh, trollish thing to do. A bit mean as well. He went tier 3. He might still be sending out a hero. We'll see, we'll see. Oh! <coughs> oh no. Beast Riders. <sighs> they can stun right. Yeah, that's gonna be absolutely hideous. We're doomed. Surprised he did not want to go with them sooner. It's gonna be an absolute pain to fight the undead from now forward. Not really gaining the gold lead that we were hoping for. They are going to be an absolute bane. Not Arthas, unlike the middle lane with a Oculus here. But Arthas getting leveled up this early on is not gonna bode well for anyone. Maybe that's gonna be annoying, but he should be able to survive this. <clears throat> now we might need Anthony top. Anthony lost finding the undead. Little magic from the Skull Crusade. Ding damage and a lot of it, just like our Bliss spell. Ah. But this tier 2 barracks will also give me gold stuffation, just like the other did before at the top. Could also send out Yuta. He could want to bring the light to the undead. But either way, this is gonna be an absolute pain. And we might have to nuke our way uh, to beat the undead. I don't think there's any other way for us in this game than to nuke enemies. If we had an army bonus, we might have been in better shape. We stay free. Defend would be wonderful, but look at this wave, man. 
Yeah, then we should be pushed first, I fear. They're not really coming out in good time for us here. Anthony is not going to be able to tank this. At least he will have some really good damage. Come on. Please kill those pesky beast riders. Left four would be wonderful with the Grey Blister spell. That's the shockway. <clears throat> that was just a normal Blister spell from the mage. <laughs> no Grey Blister spell used. Oculus not being too healthy. Which means we might be seeing another hero in middle lane soon. Ovia, sadly for us, still in great shape. We will probably return back to the middle lane. Would have been wonderful to be the one to slay it. Actually, we run through our mana here. We should be careful about that. Maybe we'll send end women here. Storm of Guards should be wonderful. But my father, the king. Did we need him? Probably not. <clears throat> I don't mind leveling up our heroes a little bit. And before he sends a survival, hopefully we can deal some great damage to him. We must trust he died. So Vanat and Tito spell. <clears throat> Let's just silence him a little bit. Oh, he is actually taking a lot of damage from the Crusaders. Some more misery. Neighbors and Anthony middle lane. Look at them getting wrecked. Poor guy. <coughs> he's, he's going out with a fight. Turn to the top. Not so convinced he's gonna perform great, Grand Magus. But we'll see what he can do. Hopefully he's gonna give us some decent gold here, at least I hope he's gonna be repaying for himself here by killing a lot of enemies. Get at least a 15. Although if we send you to top, we will not have a hero here directly against Sapphire potentially. It could be a problem. Survival indeed. Good for him that it's not an offensive portal. Yeah, we'll look good for the time being, but we're not gonna be strong enough to fight three enemy armies at once. It would be lovely if we'd actually break a tower. Okay, two spell. Let's gun save it. Guess we want to end with top, you to bottom. It's also tier 3. But look at that on that wave again. <clears throat> That's gonna be a trend from now forward. Big, massive hundred waves to deal with over and over and over and over and over again. Let's kill those pesky siege units. And win. 
is definitely not really in a great position there. Oh my god, Anthony <clears throat> is betraying us. Can you survive for 20 more seconds? Jesus. If he at least kills Savannah, he will heal himself. With the crits, he should be able to do it. But he's not going for her at all. <clears throat> Wait! I should say that more often. <laughs> <clears throat> if he kills him, he will completely heal up. Yeah, double air hole is still cheaper than one Tito spell. Let's go Tito here. <coughs> oh, he didn't slay Zavannas. I think Crown Prince. Hopefully we will get good goal from mid lane. But if we get Nusade, I'm gonna cry. Yeah, finding the undead with the Beast Riders is an absolute pain, uh, Master Sticks. Then stop here. I'm not believing you to, to just be enough here. He's a great hero, good tank, lovely resurrection and all. Survival is an absolute pain in the ass. Not a friendly port of him. <clears throat> Decides defensively to hopefully a tutor a little bit. I don't think he's gonna win this. And 16 gold short. Pretty tip for barracks. But let's still get it. We better be using the uh, Ara soon. He's still not using the image, uh, images. Uh, there it is. <coughs> yeah, that's probably gonna be enough uh, for the guy. I don't know why he's so dead keen on hitting survival. If we would just kill him, then that would be fine. <coughs> if only our army would back him up. Ah! <clears throat> Why is you to actually go for heroes quicker than and win this? He's still probably dying, but with tip 4 we might be good. Anthony is not gonna make it here. Oh, another artist. And tier 4? Jesus. He might actually survive. Um, our best bet here might actually go for level 3 castle and get the elevator in. But I'm deeply concerned we're not gonna get the gold for that. We can only get Endwin from here. Oi, oi, oi. And he got... What is it? Four different types of siege damage units. Death Knights, Beast Riders... Abominations and the scatter models from Artis. Are you kidding me? Caramel Lane. Yeah, we're not gonna be able to get the elevator top, that's for sure. I'd have to use the tier 2 spell here. Because Artis is stronger than Enduin is. And he's uh, back up by tier 4. Yeah, it's probably not going to be leaving this mid lane for a long time. That wave did not spawn a good time for us. <clears throat> we want to get put over here. But we're too late for that. Ready for action. I Look at the damage that's done here. By like just one single Fraggle Beast Rider. Oh, we even used it to spell. Yeah. 
absolute bane on that is. <coughs> if yeah, you just not gonna survive there. We will have Anthony bottom. Yeah, he's summoning those Petsky skeletons right now. Filthy Maulus. Yeah, just ignore the hero. Let's get next level of devotion aura. And gold wise, we are really not looking that good. Yeah, we are leading, but not as much as we should have been. And we're being absolute disgrace here. Karen's at least taking the under now. That's nice. Quicker than I expected. But look at this man. <coughs> Can we even get out of the base? <laughs> are we are yeah, just one research behind. We're gonna be fine. We got a big backline. You gotta know. You know what? <clears throat> That's an absolute stupid idea. But we should be able to get some experience to go there while Anthony's gonna be fine. Bottom. But we will struggle against the undead counter attack, so we will save up for the elevator here. But look at our mana level. So, yo, yo. Beautiful paladins here. So we will need Antonia, maybe a few units and then tier 3 castle. Elevator. So we're gonna need like 5,500 more gold before the 100 counts attacks us. You might not even live too long here. What a mess of a fight is this. The Forts of Lord run against the Scourge. Oh my god. <clears throat> Look at this big on that wave. He's like, meh, Kara, I don't care. Just gonna kill him. <laughs> and he's just gonna dominate the wall middle lane. For you to not get any reinforcements he needs. I think he's gonna get eaten by his little pupil uh, pu here. Uh, yeah. The undead love of FPS is striking. Oh my god, are you kidding me? And it's the barracks and it's the leaf. You're so amazing, man. Let's help that. He, Undead already used it too. It's gonna be an absolute carnage. A new rack coming for us. <coughs> and Zavanas. Oh my god. Yeah, Antwin's not gonna kill those. If he would, he would actually heal up. Which would be wonderful. Oh my god, others is coming for us in middle lane! Oh, and he can bring those extra scared to Maldus. That's just the luck we need, man. That's just absolutely the luck we need. What the hell? Yeah, Anthony, just run away, that's fine. Please kill them. It's costing me a lot of gold. Oh my god, we're taking damage there. <coughs> yep, there are those pets. He scared the mouse again. 
Oh, look at the damage she still took there. Oh, you, oh, you. Oh, you, man. Actually, I should re-say that for us. We should get the experience from him. Probably one level three. Ben Barris. But let's not forget, we will have a double hero on our hands at the top. And we're dealing with two strong armies on side lanes. Oh boy. Uh, yes, can we? Uh, we actually do have Twitch, but we are not streaming on it nowadays. We're actually streaming on Kick instead. We're already struggling with streaming to one platform. But we're forced to stream to both YouTube and Kick. But if we also do Twitch, our FPS would be in the negative. <laughs> oh boy, this wave will be fighting over there. We're so doomed up. And the elevator is gonna be in absolute pain. We're just a mere punching back this game. Let's use that before he starts wrecking my barracks. Even a single hit from the undead is gonna be deadly with those very, very nasty beast riders with that demolisher trade. We're gonna be good. Let's get the resurrection up. Hopefully, stop the undead from resurrecting all my minions. Get the voice now, right? He will benefit. Oh, and he doesn't benefit. Yeah, I actually think he benefits from it. We can't send it from the. We even got him from the top, man. Unreal. The under but even still attacking us and he <laughs> Oh yo 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 That was so messed up. Hopefully this will help Anthony a little bit over there. At least elevator will gain some experience in mid lane. That that's the only good news. But he had to apply pressure to the undead. Look at our mana levels. And this is getting wrecked over there. Hopefully we will get a lot of uh, beautiful cavalry, which will hopefully hit barracks. You can always dream. But the elevator either is gonna be stuck here for a long time or he's just gonna die <coughs> a real poor death. Even without the Crusaders living, he's not gonna get too far. So unlucky. At least we should be getting some gold. We're gonna be struggling so much on silence though. Slightly behind. Beautiful arrow fully. He's probably sending Kara to the right side. He could be sending it there. <clears throat> but I'm basically his friend me against the undead. God's up might just be enough. Your pain shall be legendary. Your pain shall be legendary. Oh my god. There is gonna be a pain. Don't tell me I also got artists. Artis oh my god. We're getting so abused. Look at this smart little flying chicken. 
Oh my god, all those images. But counts out and outs together. Couldn't be worse, really. Dude is getting wrecked. That's probably not gonna be enough. Yeah, and he's, up, as usual, ignoring enemy heroes. Elevator having fun. At least the goodness is that we will have U turn our defenses at the top. But we did not even hit a Larry at all. Look at this insane count tech already. <coughs> it's going out with the re re resurrection. Edwin is gonna tame him though. But we will need at least a double hero because we do not have this guy in our defense. Ah. <sighs> Please end the win, get rid of this wave. Because we need to look at <laughs> all the fences here. I really cannot believe we went middle lane. <clears throat> get healing, battlefield glory, beautiful. This might actually cost me greatly. This next wave is gonna be fighting over here potentially. No, oh, they will be coming out in an okay time. Might be needing four heroes to defend this though. Don't tell me Mandarin is gonna fall. Let's kill our FPS with this. Anthony really likes to die, doesn't he? Let's get the attack rate on death. I mean, those guys love to die. It's happening all game. <laughs> oh, poor Yuta. He did not even scratch Artus or Kalpzad. I love more explosions. But we also need the heroes to stay alive. Let's just use this defensively again. Look at the elevator having fun. <laughs> That's unforgivable. <coughs> this cut's out dying. Uther still alive, the big man. He loves to run around with less than 1000 health over and over and over and over and over again. And we survive. Yeah, elevator at least got us some good gold. Let's be happy about that. Let's reduce the enemy army further. First time in the game. Going for five researches at a time. <coughs> Edwin somehow still alive. Yeah, he's just slowly dying here. But he's not gonna be doing anything useful for us at all. If we would get rid of this barracks, it would be two against three barracks. We might lose it to the undead. <laughs> That's crazy. Let's see the shape of our enemies. <clears throat> oh! Yeah, he's not gonna be able to smite because of that barracks on the right side. He went quite aggressive with us a few times, but seems like he's 
Dragon Moon on the other side. And Sapphire is in perfect shape. Except for this tower. <clears throat> this elevator is gonna die in like 5 minutes. But he sh could be able to nuke him, but he's not gonna be able to nuke me, so... That's kinda good news for Stolzen. Ah, not a Kalsat, are you kidding me? Oh my god, we might also have to deal with Arthas again. But if the Arthas are losing reinforcement lane, we could actually push through the middle lane. Nah, it's not happening. Ooh, that's a bit early. So rip for us. <clears throat> this is what I mean. That was early, man. They didn't kill any of those undead heroes. It's good for his mana levels. Hopefully, this will help Anthony. I'm not counting on it. A defense, not a cane explosion. We can at least send the elevator. How about a over here? <clears throat> Ooh, at least survivors not coming for us. I do approve of that. Enemies might be smiting our special units when we send them to either the Void or the Undead. I do not want to force the Kara on my face. And we living way longer here than I assumed, but he's building up a wave already, so... He's gonna die. Will he die at the right moment for us to be sent at the bottom? Yeah, it should be right. Oh, elevator died. Yeah, I don't want the elevator on the void else. <laughs> will he go bottom? He certainly will. I think we need him badly. Time to save for the elevator top. They're with their anti-hero abilities. Oh no, it's Servia. Servia is still really difficult to get rid of. <coughs> That's one way to do it. Well, look at this, we can send the elevator top. We're good here. Oh, but will we have the gold? Just fast enough. We might not stand in front of barracks because of Vervia. That would be a big problem. <clears throat> He's annoying. Oh, 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 oh! <laughs> Oh, that's not gonna be able to just uh, smite us because then he is prone to nukes from the void house or from us even. So that's good news for us. The Bracky might be going for um, Atos for us. If I was him, I would do it. Look at the extra damage. 
from the inspiration era. Beautiful, beautiful. Let's get uh, another defend up. Block or reflect all that mess. <coughs> no break is struggling against Vival. Yeah, no break is just same kind of weird as Enwin is. He can poison enemy heroes, but he often do not even attack them. Just like he can crit enemy heroes and heal himself when they, he's killing them, but still refuse to hit enemy heroes. Uh, look at this, we're not playing any role at the middle lane with our army. But still, <clears throat> we're in the game, and as long as we are in the game, you can also win it. But else really got a lot of research. Don't tell me sending me the special unit. But <clears throat> slightly annoy the enemies. Oh, the one's going for us. Come on, man, win. Come on, elevate it. At least get rid of artists for us. Yeah, I think we will have to save up our money. <coughs> Three heroes. Oh my god. As if the elevator is a crazy strong special unit. <laughs> this is gonna be a mad counter attack. Because we do not have to deal with Kalzad. I have no words. <laughs> I have no words at all. We're struggling to, to survive every single wave. That may also even behave like that. And win. As usual, not going for enemy heroes. Please just take down Artis. That's all I'm asking of you. A new Brack and Savant survive, so be it then. <coughs> oh my god, an elder one. <laughs> Good news for Stolzen to not be attacked by survival doll. Yeah, we're not killing any, any of those heroes. And we will struggle against Alaria with their anti-hero ability. Yo, he's even getting reinforced mid lane. Thank you, Elevator. We're not even capable of killing one undead hero with a special unit and an assassin. Okay, go bottom. Nope. Oh boy, this wave gonna be funny over there. <clears throat> and the one's gonna be in so bad shape over there. That's the only hero I'm willing to send here. You will need to do it for us somehow. Get the extra resurrection in. It's like we will be needing them badly. Yeah, we're definitely taking hits. <coughs> we need to look at our top. More than we need to look at our bottom. We'll have to use the spell. Are you? I won't say. Are you kidding me, uh, Yuta? We are absolutely useless on this battlefield.
These mechanical specials will not refill this mana. <clears throat> Don't tell me he's gonna go mid lane again. <laughs> oh my god! We were even finally on that again. At least it didn't go from this barracks to the middle lane. <clears throat> this is just hilarious. Second time, man. <clears throat> I mean, survival sending the point. Um, Mustosties, yeah, that can happen. But the only thing in this game that can actually give us a breather on the side lanes keeps betraying us. <laughs> Unlucky. He's in perfect shape. He's in perfect shape. <clears throat> he might even die to the other one. Yeah, madness. Complete madness. Ah, <sighs> man, oh man, oh man. These shooters are having fun. Oh, he got dispelled, didn't he? <laughs> and when he even dies before you can attack him. <laughs> oh my god. He just gets used it to. <clears throat> Let's just the tables, heroes. Doesn't the table special units, right? Yeah. So at least Kara goes unaffected. Godzard might just be fine against Yuta. If Under loses me his middle lane, we could potentially push through here. And I'm not counting on it. We're hitting him! We're hitting him! Not much. Oh my god. The barracks. <clears throat> would be so great if we would nuke it. Yeah, it's probably gonna be alive here for too long for us. Survivor coming for us. And Kalzad. Some of the worst heroes to deal with in the game. And these are Voidal's mighty care on the right side. Come on, push through. I don't think he's gonna apply too much pressure to the honor, even if he would not have a hero over there. But the fact that we would miss him would just be perfect. Or oh, even. Oh, let's, let's just say double survival. And if we would send another hero, maybe we can block the Void Elves. Help out the elevator to push. So let's just do that. <clears throat> Essentially, just sacrificing Yuta here to keep him away and make certain he dies at the right moment so that we can either send him top or bottom. Because if we will get another one to the face, it's just not intercepting the wave quickly enough. Oi, oi, oi. Then he might be getting stuck here for a long uh, period of time. We only have one arrow on each lane. Baron will have to do a top with... Oh! <laughs> what the... We're fine! Oh my god. What the hell? <clears throat> the survival is an absolute madman. Oh yeah! Just go back to the middle lane. Ah. <clears throat> I 
He might have his heroes alive before he even attacks the undead. These Yuta is finally smart enough to hold back the Void Elves for us. Oh boy, is this, are he's still attacking us, isn't he? Oh, look at that wave. <laughs> I fear the worst. Stay chilling here. There's fun little banner for you. If we need the elevator bottom, then so be it. Oh my god, we're so laggy. <coughs> Expected that I would have been able to get the barracks here a little bit quicker wicked than we were. <coughs> Even with double arrow, we might struggle there at the top. God, third L of one. This time in the zone base. That's gonna be juicy. <clears throat> and the elevator will do absolutely nothing good there. Absolutely nothing. These units are holding back the void else. But we're still getting plenty of reinforcements here. But even without the hero, he would have been fine. <clears throat> Look at this. Endwin dying to Kelzad and Anthony also probably dying. He's not even going to be killing Artis, I assume. Please, we silence them. That should count for something. That other one will at least not attack us. Five is still being funny. <clears throat> oi, 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 oi. What a crazy battle this is becoming. And we're just a witness of it. <clears throat> Elevator is about to fall, but at least Shooter might be taking a little bit for him. Do Zara. That's lovely. Elevate dies. But Research complete. Research complete. Let's go. Cruise stack rate. <coughs> A little bit of extra damage. But without us here. And survive for a long time in the middle lane. He will essentially only have three heroes. Defending here, and maybe three years that. <gasps> oh! <laughs> he can just defend the left side with all three heroes. Oh my god. <laughs> oh boy, boy. Oh no, he's gonna be attacking us soon. That's seriously messed up for us. <laughs> oh, survival is the best. <clears throat> He's, he doesn't have a big tank. So maybe we can at least slay a few heroes this time around. I mean, come on. Yeah, we're losing this. <laughs> oh, he's actually say, uh, killing Artis there. <clears throat> That's bad for us. You know what? Let's silence them. That might keep Artis alive a little bit longer. Because the is not going to be able to use his spells. Not still has a bit, a bit of a wave. Which also gives us time to hopefully get rid of some heroes here. I'm 
not so convinced that anyone is just gonna be surviving this. But it's always a father's right to dream. <laughs> Yeah, he died. Ah, uh, not as Savannah's. Those beast riders are an absolute pain. Imagine him sending another big guy. How crazy would that be? <clears throat> and the fire, beautiful. And I don't think we're gonna be killing Arthas here with the elevator. Maybe Sylvanas, but we're not hitting her. But look at the, how big that wave is already becoming again. Poor elevator. We can send it from here. Should be easy, right? <clears throat> not a Kara. <laughs> this time it's not for fall. This is not gonna be the worst. Unreal game. Man, oh man, man. <clears throat> At least we are nuke proof, so maybe we should start nuking here if we can at least refill our men a little bit. Of course, we will have another wave of death incoming, quite literally. And we can count ourselves lucky that Sapphire knows the game too well, that he's also gonna be in trouble one against one with the undead at this stage of the game. Those under the waves are in absolute pain. Gotta love the arcane explosions. <clears throat> this wave will be fine over here. That's not good for us. Going a bit all in here. <clears throat> Might actually struggle now defense on the bottom. What the hell is... Did they, did they actually go around the world from here? That's a pure madness. Trying to take damage from the castle here. Jesus. Yeah, on that and there. Swarm waves, man. Yeah, we're gonna struggle at the bottom, that's for sure, against Irvia. We should be able to get Mandarin from here. We'll be forced to defend Kara. At least he's not gonna go middle lane this time around. If Arthas would die, it would still not mean the worst for Stolzen. <laughs> Poor castle. An hero has been uh, this is gonna be painful, man. This is gonna be really painful to defend. <clears throat> but I actually assume Arthas and Anubarak will both survive here. But he lost the tower. That's actually a big thing already. Care with the stance might still deal damage with the barracks. But him not having artists to me would mean the world to me. Artists has so much damage to my base with the summonings. <clears throat> artists got good here. No breakstop reinforcements.
And I honestly rather not use the silence until we can uh, defend here. These cuts are taking a little bit of pain. <coughs> I should be going right side. Perfect. So I'm just going to feel this, that's for sure. I'll go with my get though. Oh, you need those heroes from there. He's doing that pretty well. <coughs> He's at least feeling the pain here. If can someone destroy the main on top of everything, then that would be perfect because we can instantly send our crap from, from here to here. I would say, are you kidding me? <coughs> he did. Poor guy. He's surviving this. <coughs> he better be going bottom. But he could be going mid, who knows. Uh, good shoot to man. I know Karras is coming. And that also will still attack him out. We will be able to send the elevator here soon. But not yet. That, that's gonna be annoying for us. <coughs> He's still alive. Unbelievable. All my heroes here be sufficient to defeat a single special unit. Come on, it should be. With this big wave we're having. <clears throat> Let's not forget this wave is gonna be a big threat for us still. And it's still... Quite far out of the fight. But I wonder what this ultimate weapon is now. Ooh, survival will definitely help us out here. Let's be slightly aggressive. And when even died, unbelievable. <coughs> Gara would have won this. He would even uh, destro uh, have destroyed Anthony. Absolutely crazy. Without a wave, against my big wave with three heroes. Gara just kills them all. We're gonna have to deal with the undead at the top, but we will have men win. This is burning. <clears throat> yeah, the amazing blessing of dealing with a artist in your base, man. Might have to deal with Kara from here, and we might not be able to send the hero directly at the bottom if we go for uh, end win top. We could smite the guy though, but looking one of his barracks down would probably be the best thing we could do. What a game! We have Irvia here. <laughs> Look at this, we actually got a wave mid lane. Because of the photos not getting everything he needed. Oh my god, I, I would laugh if we were getting south in this base right now. You know what? Let's see if this works. We will struggle defending this wave. This could be our best chance of here destroying your barracks. Do more damage than in a single nuke would. They can easily smite us from now forward. 
Well, he wouldn't care for me if he can even send him. Don't know exactly when he actually sent out Kara before. But Kara would have dealt so much damage to us here otherwise. He's matching us quite well, I would say. Yeah, we're not gonna get enough mana to have to smite the guy anyway. Uh, nuke the guy anyway. Oh, the Medea Shrine not looking too good though. <laughs> I feel him there. <clears throat> I feel the spade. Would be nasty to kill him that way with the FPS. Even on them without the barracks is such a threat still, man. Ooh, another carrot coming for us. <clears throat> yeah, we might die here against Kara. Uh, unless he gets in the south. My army just feels too weak, man. <clears throat> Could be just me. The portals and on that seems to out uh, qualify us <laughs> on army strength. We got two heroes from here, so we might actually need them from the uh, middle. And only cuts out is not going to be enough because he might not be tanking those pesky clay throwers. He's not spawning as much units here anymore because it's a long lane barracks. And that hopefully is gonna be a bane for the photos of middle lane. <coughs> he could be smiting our elevator from here. Oh no, not Artis. bit unplayable I would say <clears throat> we're managing <clears throat> oh but Anthony is somehow retreated I... oh he, he wants the folks here correctly so he can defend the necropolis Look at that, the elevator is carrying us. <laughs> but he might be able to send us a few more Kara soon. Nubrek and Savannas? Oh, Art oh my god, not Artis. Why, man? Why would you do that to us? And win, and elevator can send out a lot of extra units. Battlefield glory. <sighs> double hero, though, man. You're kidding. Now we might need a double hero to deal with it. Okay, he's smiting it early to get rid of it. And he doesn't have any towers here. Maybe he doesn't have Kara Fable. You know what? <clears throat> Will we sacrifice the big guy here? He, he could also smite us. Oi, Jaina. Come on. What is this, schat? Come on, binnen. 
Look at this stuff. Een mooi klei. Wauw. Dit is een mooi paas. Ja. Zeker. Een mooi mooi hoor. Ik denk dat je ons smijt als hier. Wel hier op houden. Wat moet je even concentreren, schat? Niet te hoog, hè? Even dan het smijt, zo beet. We kunnen dat zijn zin. If it doesn't, I would not mind the elevator to die anyway. But I do mind seeing the and it get close to my Oh my god. That's a good Yeah we Anthony we have a little bit of AOE damage to deal with this. But if we lose this that would be extremely extremely nasty. I'm not killing him there, sadly enough. At least we might be forcing stalls into a smite. Although he already picked the ultimate weapon, right? And he went for the wrong one. <clears throat> Maybe we should have anticipated on that. Anthony might go mid lane. Nah, he should go top because of this way. He's not as stupid as the elevator. Come on, cut out to something beautiful over here. Longest match we have had been um, nearly around three hours, I believe. Bits in the gen didn't say Lady Bosch. <laughs> Maybe someone should uh, put a timestamp on that. We're gonna have to use the spell IP. And get our heroes from there. That's gonna be a real pain. Hopefully, it's not gonna be able to defend the elevator or and uh, Anthony. Because that might help us defend this pesky way. He should be around here. Oh my god. <clears throat> Those artillery would not get redirected somehow. Stay away from the castle, please. But this ain't looking good. My hero's ignoring Kara right now. <clears throat> of course they do. We're able to get the magic rune out of it soon. And he's fine here, so I think the Void Elves will win this. We just have to hope that we can hit him now. We might be able to smite again. The next wave we will probably lose the barracks no matter what we do. No barracks not gonna get too far. Maybe we will get one more away from the undead helping us. He did get... <coughs> Larry here and Kara. So if he gets here, yeah, he might be fine. And then get Kara from here. Maybe we'll sacrifice him at day shrine. I don't see us winning this Malibu. <laughs> this guy is absolutely in best shape. Especially if he can smite already. Oh, he even could get a Lariat from there. 
And he might be able to bring up a carry here. Yeah. But I think our best option was to go really hard here. We can hope. Yeah. <coughs> He's gonna win it. Jaina the Kami. Good enough for Ben. Nice. Yeah, we're not gonna get any lucky hits here either. Man, <clears throat> are you scratching, guys? Yeah, my arm is not strong enough. We cannot even get the special unit out. I think we're dead in this way. The undead best bet might be actually to uh, go all in on here, get rid of the barracks. Gonna try and do everything to save it, but nope, it's not gonna be happening. Bit of luck that those glaive throws hit the barracks as hard as they did. Yeah, third place probably is. But what a tough, frustrating battle that's been for us here. Not being able to do anything at all. Maybe we can be lucky with Irvia. Yeah. Please hit him or hit her. Mob to retreat. He's just going straight for the barracks. Well, my stuff is hit. Uh, I even had the star hitting Kara. <clears throat> Unbelievable. <clears throat> oh, yes, he goes in for Of course, he does. And you two might die over there. You certainly wouldn't need artists. But yeah, essentially, this is game. I think we lost the barracks. Sapphire will win it. <clears throat> I don't think we could have initiated double nuke here. Maybe we might have been able to hit him at that shrine, but it probably would not have got the damage we had to deal with. <clears throat> a bit of a rubbish special unit for us. Um, get another with the strong arm strength. Kind of meant we were always meant to be in a little bit of pain. Also, twice unlike with the elevators, for some reason, go mid lane. But we're no longer getting reinforcements here, so the elevator might go bottom. But he's not gonna be taking out the barracks. And beyond that, with the start here. <laughs> it's not gonna be too meaningful either. Yeah, they're running away. That's kinda sucky for Stolzen. Might get second place now. It certainly is what it is. <laughs> but even uh, second place in the matchup would be an amazing performance. Yeah, and that's not gonna push through. Those heroes will just only defend the portals here. Uh, actually, if we would be able to destroy its way gate and afterwards the Mente Shrine, we'd still probably lose it. I don't know when exactly he can smite. It's only 25 seconds, so he wouldn't be around here. Is he gonna be fighting Sod over there? That's interesting. Yeah, 
Okay, that's really possible, it's cool. But not gonna be enough. Oh. He's coming in. Maybe he will return. You have to try to buy him some time. Yeah, just drive away, that's fine. Yeah, I think our best option to hit a guy or to get him out of the game was to get the smite in here. And I think we did a decent job with it. We will never have enough mana to go for double nuke. Elevator will probably die here. Or maybe he can defeat survival with a bit of luck. But just says how poorly of a special they got, especially when you compare them to good old Gush. Oh, those tentacles will slap the barracks. <laughs> Bit of stuff, eh? But even three arrows needed to kill a single Kara. Okay, we'll probably just kill this up without any issues at all. But we killed the undead! <laughs> hey! For <Well>, Lord Run! <clears throat> well, we're dead. If we, if we kill Kara, he can send him from middle lane or the left barracks shortly afterwards. <clears throat> uh, maybe survival will do some fun here when it's up. Kidding, man. <laughs> Elevator will live for twenty five seconds against Kara because we can side him and prevent him from using his smite. Jaina. But don't need to five my okay. <laughs> Maybe with all those Tommy Guards. Maybe, maybe. But he will have heroes available. These will still <coughs> will survive for a little bit longer. <laughs> Not a big guy. <coughs> yeah, that was bound to happen, eh? <laughs> Double old one. If they will attack him, then we might have a chance. But he's going for us. Are you kidding me? Go bottom. Through the shadows. Hopefully survival will give him the sword. Then we might have a chance, but can we actually defend the other one in the middle lane? Um. Uh, he's smiting him. Makes sense.
But he might help me defend this one then. At least we can hope. Um, yeah. Get to spell. Garrison okay. coming. Yeah, what can we do against such reckless aid? <sighs> one will survive or release another version. I have zero clue. No one does. Only survive himself. Maybe we can get him to fight the other one. Maybe, just maybe. It's gonna happen. Oh, 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 oh. Are you kidding me? Went straight for it. Gary is ignoring the elder one, sadly not. No. Oh, I don't think we will survive. Oh, I got the spell. That's just our luck. Ten seconds. Yeah, we're dead. Arrows are not gonna be there at the right moment. Cool game, though. Cool game. I think we did an amazing job to get the second place here after all. So I'm happy with our performance. I don't think we could have done better. Sometimes it is what it is. We were fighting two really good, uh, strong enemies. Maybe better lucky that um, the Scout Crusade. Died early on, getting us into the sandwich position. But overall, I think we play good, so I'm happy. I'm happy. Um, the other one disappeared because there's a timer on them, and when the timer is finished, or survival sends other crazy stuff, I guess they can just get the spell. Um, either way, great game. See you around, guys. Bye bye.